the easy cal trick that you are about to learn now is extremely useful. It goes by the name jumping tense trick of faster addition. Basically it will help you mentally add the numbers quickly and correctly even when you cannot see the numbers written before you. So let's take a quick test and find out how good is your ability to add numbers. I will give you some numbers to add and you will have to add them mentally in 3 seconds. What is 37 plus 12? What is 44 plus 25? What is 58 plus 23? That's it. So, how many could you get right? Well, if you got all of them right, then fantastic. The method that you are using is certainly working for you. So, you can skip this video and go to the next trick immediately. Uh, in case you struggle to add these numbers, then take two deep breaths and relax. For the trick that you are about to learn now, will take care of all your two digit addition. The first question that you were given was to add 37 and 12. Well, if the numbers were written before you like this, then it would have been very simple. 3 plus 1 is 4 and 7 plus 2 is 9 so the answer would have been 49 but when the numbers are not there in front of you then it becomes a different ball game altogether you have to see the numbers in your mind's eye you have to hold them in your mind and then you have to add them and that becomes a bit of a challenge isn't it don't worry I will help you reprogram your mind so that not only you can hold the numbers in your mind but can add them smoothly as well okay so you have to do it in this pattern take the tenth digit of any number as jump and the other digit as add alright now add this 2 to 37 37 plus 2 is 39 now from 39 jump 10 once so answer would be 49 isn't it Basically, you have added 10 to 39, but you don't need to add 10. You can simply jump from 39 to 49. Okay, let's take another example. What is 37 plus, let's say, 14? Alright, so 37 plus 4 is how much? 41 and jump the 10, so it will be 51. Isn't it? Now, let me make it more visual for you, okay? What you are seeing on your screen now is called a number table. It is a very powerful tool to help you develop number sense. That is, the ability to see numbers in your mind. So, all I have done here is write numbers from 1 to 100 in columns like this, this, this. Isn't it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, so on and so forth. I've just put the numbers in column. Now, let's see how we use this number table to add numbers. Now, we have to add 37 and 12. Okay? So, mark the units digit of any number out of the two numbers, preferably the smaller number, as add and the tens digit as jump. We always mark the tens digit as jump and that is why it's known as jumping 10 technique. Alright, so now add 2 to 37, it would be 38, 39. Alright, from 39 jump 10. So, answer would be 49. Now, let's try to add 56 and 14. 
all right so this units digit is add and the tens digit is jump so 56 plus 4 is 60 and jumping 10 once will give us 70 that's your answer what is 36 plus 21 So 36 plus 1 is 37. Now you have to jump 10 how many times? 2 times, isn't it? So 47, 57, that's your answer. Are you getting a hang of it? Now, what is 64 plus 32? So 64 plus 2 is 66. Now you have to jump 10 3 times. So 76, 86, 96, that's your answer. Now are you getting a feel for numbers? With little practice, what will happen that this entire number table will get embossed in your mind. Then you don't need to use this number table. Like while you were learning how to ride a bicycle, isn't it? I'm trying to draw one. You had put those two support wheels on the side, isn't it? So that you don't fall down. But moment you learned how to balance the cycle on two wheels, you got rid of them, didn't you? Similarly, the purpose of using this number table is just to help you get the feel for the numbers. Moment you have it, you don't need it, isn't it? You'll be doing all these calculations in your mind. And it's not like that, that you have to wait for very long to be able to add numbers without this table. We'll be doing it right now. Okay? Uh, by the way, this is not looking like a bicycle, rather a poodle on wheels. <laughs> yeah, but I think you got the point. <laughs> Right, so let's do it without the number table now. Okay, so now don't look at the number table. Just listen to what I'm saying. Alright, and try to solve the question. What is 33 plus 12? The moment I say 33, try to see 33 in your mind. Try to see this table in your mind and see 33 in it. Can you see it? All right. Now, 33 plus 2 is 35 and jump 10, 45. That's your answer. Isn't it? Okay. Let's take one more example. 